I want to welcome you back to Black Side tonight. We're going to talk about actress Vivica A. Fox celebrating the passing of Kevin Samuels. First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel. Hit that like button, hit that notification button, but also comments on this video. Actress Vivica A. Fox, 57 years old, is celebrating the passing of Kevin Samuel by saying, it's all karma. Kevin Samuels was a relationship guru on YouTube who became extremely popular. Women would come to his channel and ask for his opinion, and he would give it to them. Sometimes it was harsh. A lot of women disagreed with Kevin Samuels, but somehow they kept watching because he had over 1.4 Millions of subscribers, millions of subscribers on Instagram and other platforms. But Vivica A. Fox talking on her show was so salty about Kevin Samuels because he said, if you didn't have a man when you was much younger or married younger, that you would die alone. So, so many like Vivica A. Fox and so many divestors and women on social media platforms said, Kevin Samuels died alone. He died in the arms of a Latino woman. But you have to understand this, Vivica A. Fox, that you're salty because you don't have a man. A woman who was considered one of the most beautiful women in the 1990s and 2000 has nothing to show for. Yes, she has money, but she spent most of her time crawling around following 50 Cent, tossing his salad, and that's all she could think about was that man. Instead of going out here get her a decent man. She would not have worried about Kevin Samuels making snarky remarks about her and her chasing around a man that never wanted her for the past 20 some odd years. Now she has devolved into being a sugar mama. That was the last man that we know of was with her and now she's an angry woman on a low rated Fox Soul show complaining about a YouTube guru why would you be so angry and say a word like karma to a man if the words didn't affect you but why would they affect you? Why didn't you just do what so many others do when they don't like what someone's saying? They turn it off. But this celebration of the death of Kevin Samuel is cruel, disheartening, and absolutely disgusting. Because he was not that important in the black community. If you were doing so well, you wouldn't have to worry about Kevin Samuels. If you had the man that you wanted, if you had the husband you wanted, if you had the relationship that you wanted, Kevin Samuels wouldn't affect you. But so many women believe their own hype and refuse to look at their own flaws. And that's what Kevin Samuels was saying. But the example he was setting was not for women like Vivica from A. Fox, who's 57, past her prime. It was for young women to make wise decisions. And when I mean wise decisions, make those decisions when you're young, when 
you are at the peak of your game. So when you 21, 22, and you see a gentleman who might become something, who is a talented young man, but you may not see him as having swagger. You might not see him as the cool guy, but he's going to be the guy who will give you the income and the lifestyle that you may want in the future. But when you pass those years away, and then you have children, and you're 30 years old, and you come back to that same guy saying, I'm here. And he rejects you. Vivica A. Fox was a beautiful woman when she was younger. She had the opportunity of the lip, pick of the litter of 90-something percent of black men. But who did she pick? She picked black men who didn't want her. And now she's in a position where she has a career. She has no kids. She has no man. And those words that hurt her the most was that you'll die alone. But one thing I never do is wish karma on somebody and they're dead. Kevin Samuels wasn't that important. They wouldn't do this to a white guru. Why this black man? Why did this black man get you so riled up? Because he hit a nerve. He's holding women accountable. But he also held black men accountable. It is sad to see these women jump and step over a dead body. It is shocking to see. It's shocking to hear. But it shows you how disgusting this community has become. No respect for the dead. No respect for his mother. No respect for his daughter. Because you didn't like what he said. What he supposed to say? All black women are queens. They should be queened like queens. What well, he should lie to you like Derek Jantz. And so many others who do it for the money but don't believe a damn thing they're saying. Kevin Samuels looked in the, told you to look in the mirror at yourself and basically said the position you're in today is because of you, not someone else. I want to thank you for listening to Black Sight. I hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.